You've probably heard a lot about Bitcoin, that digital currency that everyone suddenly wants to get in on, mostly because the price has been skyrocketing, but it's not new. It's been around since 2009. I wrote a book about it in 2014, and I even tried to survive on Bitcoin in New York City for 24 hours. That was pretty easy. That $20 bill you just saw me put into that Bitcoin ATM machine, it's worth like 900 bucks today. Sounds like a pretty good investment. I'd like a beef and lamb shawarma and a bottle of water. 9.34. Okay, send payment. And I assure you, that ended up being the most expensive lunch I've ever had. That $9 shawarma is now worth 420 bucks in today's dollars. But depending on the day this week, it could be worth $390. $500. And that's the thing. It shows just how volatile Bitcoin is. But if you really want to purchase some of it, this is how you do it. The process is pretty easy. If you download the Coinbase app here, you can go in and set up an account. You can choose between your bank account or a debit card, and the debit card is much faster and a lot easier. Now here's the tricky part. You're going to need to verify these transactions. So you now need to log into your bank account to see if it actually went through. All right, the last two transactions, 139 and 149. That's it, done. Now let's actually purchase a piece of a Bitcoin because right now it's trading at something like, ooh, $16,000. I'm not gonna empty out my account right away. $20 worth comes out to 0 0.001. That's like one one thousandth of a Bitcoin. That's how much 20 bucks will get you nowadays. And it's successful. We've now purchased one one thousandth of a Bitcoin. Another way to get into this is through the stock market with Bitcoin futures. That is, speculating on what you think the price will be. And if you're one of those who thinks that this is all just a giant speculative bubble, you can actually bet the price will go down. And now, to sell your Bitcoin. You hit sell. I want to sell the fraction of a Bitcoin. And here we go. Confirm sell. Now let's say you actually really want to hold on to some of this. Here's the thing, what do you own exactly? What is that value behind Bitcoin? Don't kid yourself, this is not a traditional investment. Stocks, a stock represents ownership of part of a company, and companies have property, labor, machines. The reason that Bitcoin is worth so much right now is because someone else is willing to pay more for it than you are. That's the definition of speculation. It's not investing, that's gambling.